guys, welcome back. We are on a new series today. Today we are on the map Uncharted. I created this map in Giants Editor. It took me about three or four weeks and I just released a beta. I just released the beta version on my Patreon. Link will be in the description below. The map is not completely done yet, but it is probably about 70, 80% done. We're gonna go ahead and start the series on it. So one of my family members left me this property I'm headed to right now. So we're gonna go check it out, see if the house and everything's worth living in, um, and just see what's happening. It's gonna be a big adjustment moving out here to the middle of nowhere. Um, but we're gonna figure it out. Maybe we're gonna start farming. Maybe we're gonna do some logging. I don't know yet, we'll see. But uh, there it is off in the distance. You can see the barn. I've been out here once before for a uh, an anniversary. But that's about it. So we take this road here. I think this is the driveway. Yep. Here we are. We're rolling in. Yeah, just how I remembered it. Looks a little bit older than I uh, last been here. That barn was painted red and uh, looks like it's kind of falling apart now. But uh, here's the house. Still looks to be in decent condition. Um, of course, all the paint's warming off of it and everything. But uh, it looks pretty good. Of course, I forgot to show you guys my Bronco. I got the old Bronco here, uh, looking nice. What's it? Oh, they got their two hunting shacks out here. All right, yeah, we could use those in the in the fall going hunting, putting those out in the woods somewhere. Yeah, that'll be nice. Let's go check out this house. All right, look at this. This is looking pretty good. They still got it furnished and everything. They got the TV. They got the good old fireplace and everything in here. That's very nice. Oh, they got a loft up here too. Very nice, I love that. Come in here, is this the bathroom? Yep, this is the bathroom. All right, and this must be the bedroom. Yes, it is, all right. One bedroom, one bath. Pretty nice house here. Now, of course, we only have this one barn right now. I don't know if she left any equipment for me or not. Nope, looks like they sold all the equipment before they uh, left me the property. So we're gonna have to get some equipment. Yeah, we're gonna have to get some trees cut or something to make the money and uh, Hopefully we can do that pretty quickly here. Oh, that must be the neighbor coming down the road over there. Nice, I gotta go meet him one day, yeah. I don't know where he lives, there's nobody else out here, but yeah, that'd be a nice neighbor, maybe I can borrow some equipment from him or something. It's gotta be a neighbor coming down the road, guys. I don't know who this is, but uh... Oh, sir. You're you're on the wrong prop. What, what no, are you doing no, here? You, you're on the wrong property. This is my property. I got the deed in my truck. I have a deed as well for this property in my truck. What do you mean you have the deed to the property? My aunt gave it to me. My aunt gave it to me as well. Who's your aunt? Aunt Julie. Aunt Julie? Yeah. That's that's my aunt. Sir, sir, I'm gonna actually leave the property. You're not. Nah, no, no, you're leaving the property. You're leaving it. Nah, you're, you must be lying. She I was left. here first. Listen. Finders keepers. That's not how this yeah, works. That's how it works. That is not how this works. Get Find, off the finders keepers, losers, weepers. Get out of here. You know what? I have paperwork. Who's this otherwise. guy? I swear, if he comes up to us and says he has a deed too, I'm gonna kill him. What are you guys doing here? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Well, my aunt passed away and she gifted this property to me and let, her will. Let me what guess. was your, your aunt's aunt name? Was named Julie too? Was what now? Julie? Yes. How do you oh, know? Oh aunt my gosh. Julie. She's my aunt and she's his aunt, apparently. Well, both y'all get off my property. No, and you get off my, my property. Name. No, I was here first. Well, guess what? You're on the wrong property. Don't move me. I already, I already house, moved though. in. No, no, no. What do you mean you already moved in? I got all my stuff unpacked. What kind of world is this? Lord have mercy. This is not right. Get you off the property, freeloader. Freeloader. Yeah, that's funny. Well, let's see your deed. Let's see your, all right, your paperwork. All right. Come over here. I, I got I got to get out of my Bronco here. All right, I'll grab that off the seat here. There, right here. See? This is my property. Yeah. Now what do you have to say? Here's my paperwork. It's my property. Wait, what's this number right here in your property? I get deed. It's eight point five acres. Yeah, this is what this is, right? Huh. Yeah, that's what mine is too. Yeah, that's what mine is too. Do you have a parcel number? Mine's parcel one. Oh, mine's two. Mine's three. Wait. So is this one big property, and we all got sections of it? 
starting to sound like it. I did not sign I, up for this now. I have now. to share with you guys? I didn't sign up for anything. I'm just trying to look for a good opportunity from being luckily picked by my aunt, but apparently... That's what I was thinking. So who gets the house? Have you been in the house yet? Yeah, I was in the house, and I, uh... I saw a note on the table, but I didn't look at it. All right, yeah, yeah, stay. Stay. There you go. Yeah. See, I already on pad. You know what? I was already on the, on the dresser. Oh, he's got his bag in here already. Yeah. What oh, the let's heck? Let's go ahead and start throwing that outside. Come on. No. What do no, we got no, here? No. We got a bathroom. There we go. Oh, you're you're funny. With some trees. This is it like a nature bathroom in here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, what are your what are your guys' names? Nate. Brendan. Nate. Oh, my dad told me stories about someone named Nate. It's your dad's name Nate too? Yes, he is. Oh. Hmm. What's y'all's names? Brendan. I'm I'm Chris. Maybe the note will explain why the three of us are here. Since you're here first, I think you should uh you get the honors. All right. Here's the note. It says, Dear Nate, Chris, and Brendan, I have called you all here to take over this beautiful farm. You each get three sections, 8.5 acres apiece, but there's a catch. You have a $250,000 loan yet to pay off by the end of the year. Love you, Aunt Julie. It was nice knowing y'all boys. Um, <laughs> Apparently we're all part of the same family. Did our names specifically get put on the debt? I mean... Yes, yes. It said oh, Nate, Chris, and Brendan. So, unless you know another Nate, Chris, and Brendan, then yes, this is us. You think we could just sell this property for two hundred fifty thousand dollars and just be done with it? Let's see. It's look what twenty five acres. That's uh, not gonna cover it. Even if it sold for a high like eight thousand dollars an acre, we wouldn't even make nowhere near the amount of money we would need. Oh no this. way. So, uh, well, let's ask this. What was your intentions with the property? Well, I wanted to check it out, and then I wanted to come out here and see uh, about maybe farming because I knew it was a large amount of property, but um, I just have that truck back there to my name, so I wasn't sure how I was going to get started, but my, you know, my first goal was just to kind of see the place and then build some plans from there. Yeah. What was your what was your goals with yeah. this property? I've been out here one time before for their anniversary, and uh, my plan was to use their equipment to start farming. But when I got here, all the equipment was gone, so I really didn't have a plan anymore. All of it? All of it's gone. They must have sold. Oh it wow! All. Yeah, they cleared it out. There's nothing in there. This is good space, though. I mean, yeah. Could we knock this down and sell this wood? I don't know how much it's gonna get you. But maybe we could. So we all came here with the same goal to start our own farm, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. I mean, looks like we have to now start our farm. It looks like we get to do it together. Oh, yay, sharing. Listen, didn't, weren't you taught sharing is caring? No. That's obvious. Yeah. I mean, I guess the best thing to do first is, I mean, did y'all bring a chainsaw? Yeah, I got one. I, I, guess I brought one. Yeah. I think I have one in the back of my truck. It should be in there. I got some tools in there. I, know, best, I guess that would be the best way to do Head down there, start cutting trees. Yeah, that works. So you can go ahead and leave that uh, useless Ford Bronco up yeah, there. Yeah, I was going to say, we can't oh, really yeah. put anything in there. Um, there we go. Yeah, I'm just going to steal this guy's truck right here. What do you mean steal? <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm just going to hop in the passenger seat. You think he's going to make it? That, that truck I, I was going to say, that truck looks like it's going to rust out and just fall apart. Yeah. Hope we don't have much snow up here to make it worse yeah i guess there's no one putting lime down though there's no okay so this is ours huh yeah i remember hunting out here with uh my uncle a long time ago i'm gonna back up so we can load on the truck of the bed easier yeah that's smart these are some really small trees we should be able to just throw a bunch of trees back there right i mean ooh. a lot of trees i think yeah these are, these are sticks. Where's the trees? I, I think you know what. I think we can get more money by selling these as Christmas trees, and I think we can get away with selling for trees. It's fine. Just start cutting them down.
actually didn't make too bad off that, boys. Ten grand. What did it say? Almost no. nine thousand, nine thousand four hundred dollars. What? That's pretty good. How bad for some sticks? Oh, look at this place. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, this place. Look at this place. Nate, hear me out. We yeah. figure out how much it would cost to just cut some grass, either bail it up or pick it up with a forage wagon and sell grass while the two other guys are cutting down trees still. Start dividing and conquering and we make money faster. We can get to doing those crops you're talking about. You say row, row crops? Yeah, row crop. I'll, I'll be right back, guys. I'm going to go see if there's anyone here. Think low numbers. I mean, we might have enough. I mean, these tractors aren't that expensive. These are small, yeah. rinky dink. Not the best in the world. If this is more than five grand, I'm not. I don't think it's worth it. Okay, no, good news, no. Good news or bad news first? Bad news. Bad news. Yeah, bad, bad news. Bad news is that forage wagon over there is eight grand. Eight good grand. News. Yeah. The good news is. Hold on, hold on. I got a question. Can we trade Brendan on him? Hey, hey, hey. I think he has actually, to establish value in this town before we're able to actually trade him in. No. Okay, right. so the, the good news is the Massey Ferguson, we can afford. It's $4,000. All right. Diggy dang. All right. And the sickle bar over here is $1,500. Sold. Sold. Do it. All right. All right. Go, I'll go let go him know. Him. Excuse me. <laughs> go ahead and go pay him. It is ours. Oh, All right. right. All right, we just made it back to the farm here. I think we're gonna go to the right here, or the west side of the property, and start cutting grass over here. Uh, we'll cut, our, cut ourselves out a nice little section. Go ahead and get the mower unfolded. Yeah, it's a decent size for a sickle bar mower, so. You wanna break from mowing yet? Yes, that would be great. <laughs> I'll trade with you if you wanna cut down some trees. I will gladly do that. That's a lot better than this at this point. Okay, I'm gonna head on over to you. All righty. Anything I need to know about this? Uh, no, just stick her and drive, lower it down, and go, pretty much. Just watch the grass, make sure it doesn't, like, bunch up and get stuck. That's about it. Okay, has it done that on you yet? No, it has not, but it's gotten close. So just slow down when it gets starts getting bunched up, so. All right. Like this? Yep, there you go, perfect. All right, we're just now making it to the cell point here. That was a struggle. We lost uh, a few trees along the way, but uh, we made it here with a majority of them. Let's go ahead and get these sold. We made $1,462 off of that load. All right, we just bought the uh, forge wagon here. $8,000, we gotta get it hooked up to the truck and take it back to the farm. We should be able to hook it up, it should be fine. Probably gonna have to turn around somewhere. Probably back up and just back up in there. It's probably the easiest way to do it, I think. Try not to hit their equipment. Alright. Back up. It's the one in the middle, so we'll be sure to grab that one here. Boom. Hook it up. Should be good just like that. And we'll head on back to the farm. Hey, Brandon. Yeah, what's going on? You need some diesel? Uh, no, my truck's full, pretty much. This is at you, you, seven eighths, but. Listen, we've got one liter of diesel. My team oh. take it. Okay, yeah, I'll go ahead and take it. All right, here. There you go. All right, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, your whole one liter. Don't yep. ever say it on anything for you. Where do you want me to park this forage wagon here, or loading wagon? Probably in the barn for now. I don't. Are we? It's getting kind of late. No, yeah, we're gonna... I think. Go I think it's kind of. I think it's kind of late. I think we need to call the rats for the day. All right, I'll put it in the barn here then. All right, we'll go ahead and drop the loading wagon right here. That'll work right there. We'll get back in the truck, and we'll just park Chris's truck next to the house. It's probably the best place for it. We'll park it right next to my uh, Ford Bronco here. Right on the bench. Yeah, I'm sure he'll love that. All right, well, that's in the shed. Yep, got everything put away. So... Race to the house. house. Go, go, come no, get go. out of here, get out of here. Go, go, go. Yeah, I win, I win, I win, I win, I win, I win. I was first. Oh, this is kind of nice. Is there any sleeping bags in there? No, you didn't say bedroom, you said house. Get out, get out. My bag's already here, my bag's already here. 
and again, I'll do it again. No, no, you, no. Throw no, you out there. No. I'm just gonna I, sleep in one of these fair, huts. You, Are you, oh, you guys. Well, can, I'm yep. sleeping right here. So have fun luck. with that. This is my bed. <sighs> Well, all right. I just want to let you know I'm a you cuddler. You mind a sleeping buddy? Yeah, all right. That works. Just letting you know now I'm a cuddler. So am I. So, right. that'll, that'll work great. <laughs> <laughs>